We'll be going in three, two, one. Hey, ladies and gentlemen. This is structured like an update video, but it's not going to be an update video. I just wanted to hopefully quickly get through this and tell you, kind of explain why I get encouraged and discouraged to do review videos. Uh, you know, I frequently, I have frequently made update videos where I would say, do I want to do review videos? Do I not want to do review videos? And I've, I've talked about, oh, I'm quitting. Oh, I'm coming back. Oh, I'm quitting. You know, just taking a break, not taking a break. I don't know. Well, I wanted to explain, uh, why I do this with my hand. And that is just to get my hand doing things. Um, so that's, that's that explained. But also, uh, I wanted to explain what encourages me, what discourages me uh, when it comes to doing review videos. So when it comes to making a video, it's just like I get encouraged. Usually, like for me to get encouraged in the first place, why I started reviewing in the first place back in 2014 was because I would watch reviewers. I still watch reviewers to this day. It just depends on what it is. Um, but uh, I, w I wanted to... Um, I wanted to be like, hey, I have a computer, I have a a microphone, I have a capture card, I have a camera, I can do this. And I didn't factor in how much work it would take, but I was more encouraged to do it back then. It was a lot of fun for me for the past few years, or, or excuse me, excuse me, the few years up until the past year or so. Um, it was fun because despite having problems. I got a video out, and I was like, okay, this is cool. I was also starting to get a lot more subscribers, which I still get some here and there, and I appreciate it if you do, and I'm sorry about my hair doing this, uh, but I just, it is what it is <laughs> right now. Um, anyway, um, what I do is, like, whenever, okay, when I get encouraged, I watch a video, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to do this. I'm in the mood, and when I'm in the mood, I'm just like, okay, I'm going to start a review, got all this, I got the gameplay footage captured, I just, I'm just going to sit here, and if it, if it's something on film, I'll film it, and it, I screw up sometimes, but it's not too bad, and, uh, but then when I get to actually capturing, or actually doing the review part of it, like when I'm actually doing, when I'm actually doing the voiceover over the gameplay, that's when things get a little complicated for me because I, here's the thing. The program I use, I use an old dinosaur of a computer by technology standards. I use an old dinosaur and the newest technology I ever have to make these type, make any video on my channel is either if I have a newer phone, which for some reason this one, whenever I have it facing me, it, I do not know how to get it out of 480p, but it is what it is. And um, if or if I you you know gameplay capture from my Xbox or PlayStation or something, um, whatever can upload. Um, but most of the time I use PowerDirector 8. That's not even fully updated, and I doubt I can really get it fully updated by now. Um, but it's because it's a really old program. Um, so that's what I have to work with right now. The out of all the years I've been using it, using uh stuff, that's what I've had to work with. So um, the so factoring that in, um, it likes to crash on me a lot. Even when it seems like features that are just completely fine, just it just crashes. So that's a little discouraging. Like um, literally. The other, I think the other day, as of this recording, I was opening the program to start the review or go back to the review I've been currently working on. As of again, as of this recording, and it just crashed. Like it just nothing. I did nothing. I just opened it and it crashed. I didn't even have like a whole bunch of stuff set up to where it would even cause that. No, it just it just just flat out crashed. So that's that's a little discouraging for me, um, and. Uh, the um what else am i trying to say here whenever i would mess up when i'm doing a voiceover it's like okay no, uh back in the day i was just like uh it's it's frustrating to mess up but i'm just like you know what i'll just i'll try it again um i would just leave it there i'd leave the voiceover thing there i'd leave the the, the voice clip there i should say 
I'd leave the voice clip there, but it started taking up much more room. And I was just like, okay, for, uh, from now on, if I screw up, I'll just delete it. Well, depending on how much I'm progressing through the video, it can take like what's, what feels like a minute to get it going or like half a minute to get everything settled. And then just, you start up again and like, you know, you start up, uh, try not to screw up again. So lately, if I screw up, it's been really frustrating for me because I know I have to go through all this process again. And all those half minutes can add up to multiple minutes. So um, it gets pretty frustrating. Um, and also, I don't know. It, it Past couple of years, that's gotten to me where I'm just like, you know, do I want to risk doing this? Do I want to waste time doing this thing that I'm been trying to do for fun when it's no longer fun what's the point because i don't make money on these i don't have a ton of views on these so the, these are for fun but when it's not fun you know like i said what's the point um so that's why i've been like lately i've been like okay i need to do this when i'm absolutely in the mood this is why i'm, I'm doing this like why i'm in the mood and and just or excuse me when i get in the mood this is why i have to do it i don't know what i'm saying anymore <laughs> i'm trying to get words out here but basically um i have i absolutely have to be in the mood or otherwise i can't make a good video so um that's why i've been a little less frequent in making review videos recently like um a pa a, a part the little for the past few years, I've been having like multiple uh, review shows and stuff. But uh, this latest one, I literally made because if I'm not in the mood, like there's no story that you're waiting on. There's there's nothing like that. You may be waiting on a new review video, but you're not waiting on a story. Like what's going to happen in this conclusion? That's why I ended the Dang It Show. That's why I ended Danny Tree Frog when it comes to reviews. Um and that, that's why I'm, you know, stuff like that. Like, because I started stories. Yet another review show was a bit different. Like, it's similar to what I'm doing now. But, um, you know, I, I've just... But basically, all together, I've decided not to make any more that would have stories. Unless I just have some multi-part thing where the story isn't canon to anything. It's just, it's just one thing. Uh, maybe a running joke here and there. But not, you know, I, if I wanted to end it, if I wanted to cancel it, and you wouldn't be on a cliffhanger or anything. Um, but I just wanted to say that, uh, when it comes to doing reviews, um, it could, if I'm in a good mood, if I'm in the mood to do it, there could be like three in a row within like, uh, a couple weeks or so. Uh, or if I'm not as much in the mood, there could be a few months before you see another. So, um, there's like a pretty big gap between my latest review video or my video, my review video from last year and this year. So, uh, you know, that's, yeah, basically what I'm trying to say is this is why I'm, I have to be in the mood. Otherwise I can't do it. Um, can't do a review video and stuff. I will say doing let's plays is a lot easier. It's a lot easier on me. Like, yeah, I can get a little frustrating trying to line up the audio with like the picture and stuff. Exactly. Uh, but they're a lot better to work with. They take longer to upload because or to upload and, and render and stuff because obviously there'd be longer videos. But um, that's just that's a lot easier for me. I might start doing something like that. I don't know. But um, as of this recording, uh, I don't know if I'm going to consider this an update video or not. But uh, this is just something I wanted to get off my chest. Is I have to be in the mood or I can't do it. If I ever get more subscribers and better technology where things are a little more like incur you know, be like, you know, people more and more people are coming for reviews and then I get better technology where it doesn't crash on me as much, I'm like, okay, I think I can do this. Um But uh until then, it's gonna be on and off again review stuff. Uh I will probably still call it Danny's review show, but we'll have to see where that goes. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching this video. Uh, like it if you want to. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep it up. If I'm going to keep it up, then, you know, whatever, whatever the case is. 
this isn't an update video. It's just structured like one. Anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more videos. And I may start doing stuff like this if I want to just talk about something. Uh, it, just, it just depends. I may have it more professionally set up if I start to do it. But again, this is this is kind of like the review videos where I just do it if I feel like it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, thanks for watching.